I'd now like to show you a couple resources that you can use to gather information for your career report. The first is a website. It's the United States Department of Labor Bureau of Labor Statistics, or BLS. And the website is just bls.gov, as you can see up here. One of the first things that you'll notice about the site is the amount of information is almost overwhelming. These drop-down menus are huge and it can be very difficult to figure out where to start. Uh, as I was working my way around different areas, uh, I found that actually the best place to start is to just use the search bar right up here. Um, and the search results that, that popped up were actually quite useful. So. I, uh, one starting place would be to put in the the name of the career that you're interested in. So just for example, I picked graphic design. And maybe I would have been a graphic designer in another another lifetime. <clears throat> and I selected the first link, <clears throat> and it brought me to this: the Occupational Outlook Handbook, 2010-2011 edition. And what this feature is, you have a nice, actually this is sort of set up how your report might look, um, a nice overview of the contents, headings, nature of work. So you have a nice introduction, what do graphic designers do, talks about the work environment, where they work, training, other qualifications and advancement, and notice we have subheadings for education training, other qualifications, advancement, employment and job outlook. At times they link to some of their other reports and statistics. Earnings. And then down here is very nice, they have related occupations. So you might find that you want to explore some of these as well and include them in your report. So that was just up here using the search feature. You also have subject areas, and you can look under this um, employment large heading um, and look at employment by occupation. And the path to finding the information that you need at times can be longer going through this channel, so I recommend using the search feature. So that's the Bureau of Labor Statistics. The other thing that I wanted to show you was the school's website. If we come over here, hgtc.edu, from Quick Links, scroll down and select Library. And now we're going to search the catalog. And the catalog is all of the physical holdings that the library has um, in Conway, Grand Strand, and Georgetown. N uh, let me go back for a second. Notice that I clicked on uh, Advanced Search, okay? And I'll show you why in a second. Um, Okay, we can select the libraries that we'd like to search, and so we can select all of text libraries. And now we can search by keyword, author, title, subject area, and so I'm going to pick a, a broad career path that I think there would be lots of, of sources on and show how I would narrow it down. Subject area, nursing, okay, now I won't go through it entirely, but the first time I clicked on it, I got lots of searches, and the first page didn't contain many things that, that were, were overviews to the career and the things that I would probably need to complete this report. So I added in a keyword. I had subject area, nurse, and keyword career. Notice I have the and connecting them. And then I click search. And I noticed that it was much more refined. And so, second entry here, what can I do now? Nursing, the Vault Career Guide to Nursing, Your Career in Nursing, the Nursing Experience, Trends, Challenges, and Transitions, a General Nursing Overview, and I can see down at the bottom for each entry if it's available at the library in which campus. Right, so it looks like we have some Conway and Grand Strand. I can click on the details. And this is where I'll access the call number. So when I actually go to the library, I can look it up alphabetically first and then numerically. Ask a librarian if you're having trouble. 
Um, at times you'll get uh, a summary or maybe a table of contents so you can actually look in and get a little in more information before you go and check that book out. Is this going to be helpful and beneficial to what, I, what I'm doing? Uh, so there you have it. That's the catalog and the Bureau of Labor Statistics. Again, if you have any questions, send me an email. Thanks.